quick tip. Let me give you some good knowledge on how to determine the time you want to finish working regardless of the amount of stops you have. I promise you this is not because I'm a math teacher, but it's pretty simple. So let's do the calculations. So let's say I have 180 stops today and I start delivering packages at 11.30 and then I want to finish delivering by 6.30 or I stop delivering at 6.30. So from 11.30 to 6.30, that's seven hours. So I would divide 180 stops by seven hours and that's going to give me 7 into 18 goes 2 times. 7 2 is 14. 18 minus 14 gives me 4. I bring down to 0. 7 into 40 goes 5 times. 7 5 is 35. And then 40 minus 35 is 5. 7 into 50 goes 0.7. All right? So this is 25 per hour so 25 stops per hour but what I would do is bump it up to 27 or 29 because I want to account for my 250 minutes break if you have apartments then that means you just have to move faster so in short all you have to do is divide the amount of stops you have by the total number of hours that you want to work if you want to work if you want to finish working in 10 hours you do 180 divided by 10 and that's gonna give you 18 stops per hour Simple.